Hello, hello, hello. Althamir here. And today we are going to be just going over some more housing things. Um, like what's new in... Uh, like what's new in terms of being viable. Just just looking at just strictly things with the name Necronomen um, and Apocrypha. And also looking at the achievement um, furnishings and the home goods furnishings, seeing what's different there. Um, I did decorate this house just a little bit, but that was more for fun just to see what these things look like. So this one is, uh, so as you can tell, we actually do have some things here. So we're going to be doing this as quick as I can. Um, I don't want to make this video super long. So this is just some, some wind chimes. Not bad. Now the price will obviously be different. These are PTS prices. And these are purchased ones. So purchased with crowns. These ones are purchased with crowns. What I'm doing right now. So keep that in mind. Don't get too attached to these. If uh, you don't like spending crowns on furniture. And instead you like crafting them. Or looking at the furniture. The, the achievement furnishings. And the home good furnishings. This is the Necrom bench chair two counters not bad table elegant for elegant dining let's see some pictures here yay kind of like this one so far I mean it's well it's not bad the bowl, so your guar can take a pee. We got some bookshelves here. I don't like empty bookshelves. Like God, it takes it takes so long just to fill these. That's why I like these other ones. I love this one. It's all full. Like that's so great. It looks so great. And again, empty. Ugh, boring. No, pass. Full. Yes. Thank you. All the time. Necrom shelf. Lighting. These are kind of cool. Small little candle. Another candle. Necrom lamp. Elegant. Necrom lamp. Elegant. Standing. Ooh. Chandelier. Ooh, wow, that shouldn't have done that. Uh, a Necrom fire pit. Elegant. Not bad. Necrom lamp post elegant. And, you know, just as just let you guys know, the reason why I'm not buying these and like putting them on my boat is just because I just, I don't want this video to take forever. <laughs> I'm doing this on a whim. I thought it would be a really good idea. <laughs> As I was messing around with BTS. But anyway, this is the Necrom Sponge. Elegant. Holler has 15 things. Oh my lord. Banner. Long patterns. Banner. Medium bronze stitched. Another banner. Now if you want to look at these like closely, you can always pause the video. Um, I'm not going to... There's 15 of them here. <laughs> Medium pattern. Banner, medium, stage, a uh, sage stitched. Basically the same thing over and over again. Pattern does well, oh, okay, the pattern changed there. This is a uh, narrow pattern. Small pattern. Small sage. Not bad. Some rugs. Ooh, that, that's a bigger. Yeah, this is a large house item. Yeah. So, probably should have been saying that, but. This is a large house item, carpet. Standard house item, carpet. Small house item. Not bad. Like this one more. Tea table. Need to sip some tea. Small house item. Some vases. Some flowers. For all you flower fans out there. That one's kind of cool. Okay. Sweet, some beds, necron bed, 
Double bed, single bed. Yeah. Married, divorced. Dividers. You get the dresser here. Mirror that hasn't been cleaned since the Merithic Age. Uh, trunk. Let's see, we get some uh, Undercroft gravestones here. Large, large, uh, standard house item. A memorial small. Incense. This is a small house item. Kind of cool. Some urns. Not bad. Not bad. Now we're going to go with the Apocrypha ones. Got Boulder, and that's, wow, that's, this is a large house item. You can already tell this is pretty big when the camera has to go, oh, yeah. Got some shrubs, and these I do actually have out. So I can show you these, at least some of these. You got the shrubs, that, these are bright. These are really bright. Oh, I didn't show you the other one. Got a, uh, a sucker leaf, which not bad. This one's kind of big, though. Don't let that deceive you. That's big. You got the Apocrypha tree uh, fossilized, which, eh, whatever. I like these, but they're big. Uh, Apocrypha tree spore. Apocrypha chair. Uh, large specimen jar, empty. Pretty cool. Get a library, get a desk, and a podium, candle lit. Pretty cool. Tentacles holding the candles in. I like that. Shelves empty. Boo. Boo. Shelves full. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Got some candles. Desk candle. Pretty nice. I always like the Hermias Mora stuff more anyway. Lamp for the floor. These are some sconces. These are actually pretty big. Um, Size-wise, and I'll show you as quickly as I can anyway. I don't want this video to be like 3,000 hours. Tea table. Daedra like tea. And apocrypha bed, which don't roll over. That's going to hurt. I'll show you the, the trees here. I could rotten. So this is the tree spore. Again, pretty big. Sucker leaf. Awesome name. Again, pretty didn't think it'd be that big. That's the buster. Again, kind of bright, you know. Kind of bright is another tree spore. Those are tree spores over there. Uh, where's the captain's quarters? I think this is the captain's quarters. Yep. Um, they're down there. I'm stupid. After this is going to be the achievement furnishings and the home goods furnishings. So there's the podium. Nice. There's the sconces. Again, you know, fairly big. That's also a pet that comes with it. That's the chair and the candle with the desk. Uh, the bed. And the nightstand. And we're going to go down here. Uh, I had the specimen jar in there too, didn't I? Yes, I did. I made this into a dueling area. <laughs> I think it would be great for duels, but I said that in the other video. That's the uh, Apocrypha lamp. It's, you know, that's the empty specimen jar. That's these other, that's the sconces. See, they, again, they're kind of big, but they work. Made, it definitely made this area brighter, for sure. And that's the other ones there. See, if you turn them off, this area is a little dark. But you turn them on and it just instantly makes that just so much brighter. I like that. 
So that's it for uh, at least the Crown Store bought furnishings, which again will be cheaper. I mean, cheaper. They can't get much. They're cheaper in the PTS for testing and stuff like that. So now we're going to go to the Peninsula. And we're going to look at the achievement furnishings and the home goods furnishings. Probably going to be around the same stuff, but we'll see. Really nice loading screen. Yeah, it's, I don't know. I don't like this it's called the Bonnie Peninsula. It's not really. It's only some of the peninsula, right? But whatever. Why that bothers me. And shut up. Nobody cares. What? Sorry if I'm going the wrong way, for those of you who have actually done this before. I haven't really explored the city that much, so... Sure, it's probably connected. Why not? It's not connected. Oh great, I'm so happy I went in here. Oh wait, no. It's, oh, wait, no. Every time I think it's not. No, it's not. Stupid. Oh, wow. Look at that. It looks like she has hardened wood on. And he's waving at her? He's being a mime. Is he dumb? Anyway, sorry. Probably should have pre-route this before the video, but this is half the fun. Me looking stupid. I did. I, I just did a loop, didn't I? I then. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Final rest furnishings. That's not ominous at all. Kind of creepy. Are they gonna kill me in here? All right. Achievement furniture. This one's probably the coolest. Dark elf family. Probably not though. All right. So we have. An apocryphal altar. Okay. Turn up, turn down, up, down, up, down, up. Sorry, ADD. Um, doesn't say it's a tr traditional furniture. Everything's traditional furniture. The courtyard pool, which isn't on. I really thought there'd be like black water flowing out and looking kind of cool. No. Okay. Portal seal. Okay. Now, I will say, um, before I get too much further, sometimes these things can be spoilers for what happens in the main story. Sometimes not, though. You know, but just, just in case, if you don't want, if you don't want to go any further, like this one requires Defender of Necron achievement. I assume that's the last achievement, but sometimes it's not. I don't know, this is Master Angler achievement. You get this cool little thing. Put these around your house. This is kind of cool, but it kind of reminds me of this is the Crystalline Mind Barrier. Uh, this kind of reminds me of the, um, the Somerset tutorial. Though, you know, it was all like inside someone's mind and you have all these bright crystals and stuff like I don't know maybe we're going back there uh, dormant try tyrannin dying something it's a crystal cool may as more banner noise necrom archway okay
Necrom ceremonial thing. Kind of cool. I like that. I like that. Replica Fate Weaver key. Okay. Tales of Tribute kit. Wow. Awesome. And a Lord of Fate and Knowledge. Kind of like a pitcher. That's not bad. I like that. A lot less Apocrypha stuff than I thought, but they, I mean, obviously, they have to sprinkle in some Necrom stuff, right? I like this stuff. This and uh, this. Uh, and the banner. Are my favorites. The pool would be great if actually, like, turned on in a way to get the water, like, black water from it. That'd be cool. That wasn't too bad. What do you think of that one, guys? Home goods furnishing. Okay, so again, oh, Jesus. That was bright. So, there was that plant again, that plant again, okay. That plant again. Repeat. I thought there'd be something different. Usually, the crown store stuff, furnishings, or stuff you can't get in this. So, I thought it would be like this plus the, you know. Apocrypha Boulder. Again, that was there too. Typical fire logs, whatever. Mushroom, cool. Yeah, mushroom. Jump and just eat it. Another mushroom that's melting. Got some guar cabbage plants. It's pretty neat. That's not a really interesting area, right? Like, more in the general. Vardenfell in this area is just very interesting and just very unique. And the typical, the typical stuff here. Gnarled laurel. Not bad. I like the mushrooms. These are cool. And for those who don't want to buy those Apocrypha things, at least some of the plants, you can get them here. And they're actually not that bad. This one's the most expensive at 20k. Gold. It's not too bad. Oh, not bad. So, what do you think of those guys? It's going to be it for this video. Um, overall, not bad. You know. Could be better, but I mean not bad. You can also put you can also put this little guy in your house too. So he makes some really weird freaking noises. But um yeah, thank you for watching guys. Don't forget to like the video if you did like the video or I mean you could pretend you like the video too if that's your choice. I'd appreciate it very, very much. And I'll see you in the next one.